to suck for you. Um, <laughs> they get nailed in the rib. We're going to put a pad right over that spot. Same concept, okay? You're going to put the elevated part of this pad, and this is hard, okay? But we pad it with similar padding such as this, okay? And I'll just put it on like this, I guess. Um, again, I don't think this is fit for a rib, so keep that in mind. Um, this is called orthoclast. You just put it in like boiling water, and you cover her up, and then you put like this over top of it, and it molds so you get this nice bend. So, a little tip for the day. Okay, so pretty simple. We're just going to have her hold it. She got hit right there. <laughs> so what are we going to do? This is on the rib. Might be some sensitive skin there, but what are we going to do if, if she's going out and playing in this? Uh -huh. Clean the skin, right? And then what you can do before this is actually tape it down and then secure it with this. You'll see that typically if, if this is either on the rib, or you can also do it where it's on the shoulder, the AC joint, you'll see it taped down before they wrap it up. Okay, so keep that in mind. That's something that I'll ask you on the test. All right, so she'll hold it for me. We'll pretend it's taped. Um, probably not taped, but Tuscan. If you're doing it directly on the skin. <laughs> <You're good. laughs> ah! Excuse me. <laughs> so keep in mind, this is the part of the body where we're enclosing pressure on the lungs. Okay, so once you get it on and it's secured, you don't need to pull a whole lot after that. Okay, and then when we do secure it, are we going all the way around or no? No. Yeah, I will. Okay. If you do, for any reason, make sure it's some sort of stretchy tape or power flex, okay? Because that has more give, and don't pull it to its full stretch, okay? So keep those things in mind, and that's something I can ask on the test, too, okay?